I used to see God as someone that's up there, pero wala kaming connection, wala siyang pakialam sa akin. I didn't grow up feeling loved at home. My life before was focused on pursuing like things of this world, and I sought fulfillment through extreme sports, mountain bike, business, and different relationships. But when I became a husband and a father, I had a hard time raising our six children. And everything was chaotic since I didn't have a guide on how to lead my family. Daming conflicts and a daming sleepless nights. The desire to be a better husband and a good tatay sa mga anak namin, we tried to homeschool even though we don't have an idea about that. Because we wanted to have a good relationship with them and to be more intentional with them. There is a, a CCFer who shared Jesus with us. Muna, we were so hesitant and sabi ko hindi yan para sa amin. And we don't deserve to go to church uh, because of our past, yung mga dami namin nagawang mistake. It's good that He endured and He shared the gospel to us even we are not inter interested. But by the grace of God, at chinese ng gayong heart namin at we surrendered everything to him. We realized namin that God is our perfect heavenly father who never stopped reaching for us, reaching out kahit ang sama-sama namin, forgave us and loved us unconditionally. He's always with me and because Jesus died for me, even though I'm a sinner and very proud, I had to send, surrender my all to serve him in the best of my ability. Lahat na experience sa dinaanan, lahat ng mga ginawa namin for His glory alone. I'm still far from having a perfect life and still a work in progress. But I know that me and my family's hope and future are in His hands. There are no limits to where God's faithfulness will take you.